17th birthday haul, also a collective haul because I have collectively so weird. I collected a lot of things over the summer and for the past I would say two months now and yeah I haven't done a summer haul yet so might as well do one now but other than that let's get on with it. I'm just gonna break this down in order by the product. So first off I have the least amount of products from this category and it's skincare and this one I got from Sephora. It's the Neurogen's Biofill God's Really Lemon or In Lemon. Like scent lemon. Anyway, it's just like a little exfoliator and I want to try this. Obviously a Korean brand. Um, I didn't know Sephora was starting to go deep into K beauty, but very excited. And I've used this about a couple of times. So far, first exfoliator that doesn't irritate my skin. So well, except for my neck. It got really red up there, but on my face. It's okay. I also went to Lush and got the Mask of Magnanimity. Minty? Magnanimity. Sounds like I'm saying a nimin. A nimin. Yeah, anyways. But this is a face and body mask and it smells like peppermint, like straight up peppermint. If you don't like that smell, I don't think you'll like this. I need a new moisturizer. So I got the Kim Thai Ultra Wonderless Moisturizer. And if you didn't know, I love Kim Dai. She's one of my favorite Vietnamese people to watch on YouTube or here on YouTube. And if you didn't know, I'm also Vietnamese, so it's great to support another Vietnamese person on here. So uh, yeah, I want to try this and I quite like it. It doesn't feel thick. I grabbed quite a bit of makeup over the summer, but most of these products are from ColourPop, my fave, my favorite brand. And they're making new stuff and they're gonna kill my bank account. I'm just like, <sighs> Speaking of color pop, this is from their recently stock. This is the uh, Yes Please palette. Very beautiful. I'm using this on my eyes right now. This warm tones, like, I'm just mostly, I would just zoom my eyes on this color because I love yellow. And as you can see, I'm already decked out in yellow. If you want a good, affordable, warm toned palette, this is one for you. They also got new, was it crystal collection? Something like that. I actually wanted to get the setting spray, but I got the wrong one. Still using it though. This is the Rose Court Crystal Priming Spray. I am using this on my face. And I'm never to be the one who believes like spray primers because I always like to use the liquid. Actually, this is both liquid one I'm Honestly, I kind of like this because every time I wear this, I feel like my makeup looks better. And I'm actually wearing it today. Wearing it. Using it. There you go. It got dark. All of a Where did this one go? Um, this one you're seeing, this is ColourPop uh, Super Shock Cheek in Holiday. Very beautiful. Also wearing this on my cheeks. I don't love this. It's like my all time favorite blush. I never really wanted to love the very bright. Colors, but on your cheeks, it just looks so subtle and very fresh and young. Then I got a press powder, and this is in Play by Play, and it's in a little container because I don't have the little magnet palette. And it's very pigmented, and it's very beautiful shimmer, and I I just love it. So many of you ever seen my previous makeup tutorial video. And this is the Love Fair collection. And this is what it looks like. It comes with the Super Shock, wait, yeah, the Super Shock shadows. And it's beautiful. Yeah. Also have this little mini lippy bar thing. And whenever you like it, spend $20 or something, you get a little mini lippy. Yeah, mini lippy. Little, little lippy. Little lippy. And I want to get a red, this is a full on red color, and this one is in Trust Me. I also needed a new eyeliner to try, so again, I wanted to support another fellow Vietnamese YouTuber, and it is Michelle, and she owns M Cosmetics. And this is her illustrative eyeliners, and this one I have, I have both, it's the brush tip and the felt tip, and I wanted to try them. And I quite like them. It's easy to apply, but one thing I don't really like about it is that it's not as 
pigmented or as black as you want it to be. But I don't really mind because I always go over my eyeliner. So you also have seen this in my last makeup tutorial. And it's Beauty by Bells Beauty. Again, fellow YouTuber that I want to support. And it's a collaboration with BH Cosmetics and 12 Colors. Beautiful palette, very affordable, and I totally recommend it. I also wanted to try a new mascara. Fun little story. I went on Sephora and bought the Benefit Pro Lash and tried it, hated it, and returned it for something else. I didn't like the mascara, so I wanted to try something else. So I got this instead. This is the L'Oreal Paris Luminous Waterproof Mascara. It does hold my curls, but not as much as my first mascara I did, which is the Maybelline Rock Mascara. I also bought some pair of earrings, or actually three pairs of earrings, from this A, and it's like affordable, like everything's like a dollar. So I have one pair online right now, and it's just circle earrings with little dangly. Yeah, anyways, but I also got this dangly hexagon earrings and it has like little jewels on them, like like studs, sorry, like studs, and then it's dangly with the hexagon. The last pair is just this dangly circle earrings, again, it's the circles, I'm sorry. It's just a little circle with a dangly string of Now on to the clothes. I went on Shein and bought some things. I got this top and it's just this really cropped black top with a very straight line and it also has really cool like red, blue, navy stripes going down with a zipper and it actually is a zipper. You can put that's a line now I think about it. Saw so this on Jen Imes video. Where she bought this, I fell in love with it, so I want to get one myself. I went on Shein, very excited about this for like six dollars. Six dollars? What? Six dollars. <laughs> six dollars. And it was like on sale, so I was like, what do we I also got a pair of culettes, is that what it's called? It's like one like of those long, wide pants, but it's like short. It's not actually short on the model. It looks shorter on her, but on me, it fell to my like normal me. But anyway, it's just this black one and it has ties in the front so you can easily adjust it to your waist. And yeah, it's just long, long wide pants. I bought some things from Strata for like three pieces for like $16. And if you didn't know, it's like a scrap store that's online. And I got this black skirt because I needed a simple black skirt. The other one was a lot sheer. This one was kind of sheer, but like when you wear it, it's not sheer, which I find that weird witchcraft. This one is from the brand Brandy Nova. So then I bought this jean shorts, very casual. And I think it's very cute. It has pockets in the front and also in the back. This one I know. But I like it and it's very cute. And the last thing I bought was this shirt, and this is a just a yellow silk top, very cute. I wanted this kind of top in my right now because I like it. <laughs> then I went on Zappel, and I know there's so many things that people talk about Zappel. I say they improve with quite a lot, but then I wouldn't know. It's just this off the shoulder, floral, rustic pink color, and it's very beautiful and I thought this, the material was going to be common but I didn't pay attention. There's a slip in the front somewhere. It's comfortable and I got the right size. I then went two bras and these already have like the hangers already because I'm too lazy to take them off. But anyways, here's this. You've already seen this. It's like an off the shoulder with like shoulder kind of deal. That was cute. and. I'm not a I've already seen most of the clothes because I've worn it in my lookbooks. But um, here's one of them. And this one was in my three outfits one lookbook video. It's like an almost a grayish, purplish color with some floral on there. It's just a simple top. So then I got a pair of leggings. It's just black and white with a see through mesh thing right in between the colors. I don't know, I need a new leggings so 
I want to try this one out. I went to TJ Maxx quite recently actually and bought myself this off the shoulder. It's like a jumpsuit now, I think about it. It's like off the shoulder jumpsuit with the coolettes that I'm talking about, like the wide legs. This is actually short this time. It also has pockets. Pockets in the front. I was very excited. It's a very nude color and I downloaded it in my this one you also have seen in a lookbook in a previous video. I have this palm tree leaves kind of baseball crop top and quite like the style. The button fell out but I fixed it. Also this is from Forever 21. I went to Goodwills. I got two shirts, two button ups actually and this is also in my summer lookbook. This one is just a almost like a silk top. It's very comfortable though. Yep. And then I also got this what color? It's like a mm, I don't know, but it's just this denim button down shirt. Or button up. Why is it button down? Button up shirt. If I don't come in here, I'm filming. I bought some socks. You can wear flats or like shoes or whatever. I can't see. It's kinda like that. <laughs> anyway, I needed some of this and come with pairs of Three, so yeah, there's this. These were from Ross. All time favorite shoes. Love them and I can go to shoes at the mornings a whole bunch of times and it's kind of crazy. But yeah. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoy my haul, collective haul, and 17th birthday haul. Oh, if you guys didn't know, for my 17th birthday I got money, so that's why some of these products were from that money. But I didn't spend I don't spend all money, but yes. Anyways, um, other than that, hope you guys have a good day and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!